it worked out and it all like it all actually worked out and it took me a very long time to compete on this level. If everyone saw my riding when I was 20, they probably wouldn't have thought that I would reach my, well, let's say like my peak when I'm 27. And it's really time to celebrate. This is my third Olympics. So far I had a, a very good year in my uh, snowboard contest and I really wanted the, the Olympics uh, to happen this year. And when they were talking about moving it, uh, I was like, oh, like, please, no, I, I want it this year. So I'm very, I'm very happy that, that it happens this year. The half pipe is really amazing. I think all the riders love it. And at the same time, the whole venue is, is very interesting to be up there. Like when you're at the start of the half pipe, you see on the left side there's a slope star course and then the snowboard alpine course, there's the border cross and ski cross course, over there's the moguls and aerial. So it's really like, a, um, it's a lot of things that are happening at the, in a very close spot, which is amazing, obviously. Like this is exactly, I think, what is all, what is, what the like, Olympics are about, that it's many things happening at a, at a very small, very small space that are usually like very far apart so it is very interesting and nice to be here. I would say the first time I actively started thinking about the Olympics was one and a half years ago. I started to learn new tricks. I wanted to learn tricks, to, uh, to learn new tricks, harder tricks and it worked out really well. Um, I invented a new trick there and it made me realize that I could really step it up and take my riding to, to a whole other level. Yeah! Because before I was not really a, let's say, a, a podium rider. I was always like a top, a top eight rider and did not have too many podiums. And there I'd stepped it up with my tricks and, and really realized like, ah, oh, this could actually be this could actually be a thing and I could actually, like timing-wise, it would be perfect timing for the Beijing Olympics to really step it up and then go there and, and make something huge. But before it was more dreaming about it but not really seeing myself doing it, you know what I mean? I, saw, I, thought, I thought the dream was up here and not here, you know, and now I see, I see the dream in front of me that I can actually reach it.